Lent, a time to renew, Friday of the first week of Lent. Opening Prayer Lord, you have blessed me with many gifts. Help me to better use them in service to my brothers and sisters. Amen. Bible Readings Ezekiel chapter 18 verses 21 to 28 But if a wicked person turns away from all the sins they have committed and keeps all my decrees and does what is just and right, that person will surely live, they will not die. None of the offenses they have committed will be remembered against them. Because the righteous thing they have done, they will live. Do I take any pleasure in the death of the wicked? Declares the Sovereign Lord. Rather, am I not pleased when they turn from their ways and live? But if a righteous person turns from their righteousness and commits sin and does the same detestable things, the wicked person does. Will they live? None of the righteous things that person has done will be remembered. But because of the unfaithfulness, they are guilty. And because of the sins they have committed, they will die. Yet you say, the way of the Lord is not just. Hear you Israelites, is my way unjust? Is it not your ways? that are unjust? If a righteous person turns from their righteousness and commits sin, they will die for it. Because of the sin they have committed, they will die. But if a wicked person turns away from the wickedness they have committed and does what is just and right, they will save their life. Because they consider all the offenses they have committed and turn away from them, that person will surely live, they will not die. Matthew chapter 5 verses 20 to 26 For I tell you that unless your righteousness surpasses that of the Pharisees and the teachers of the law, you will certainly not enter the kingdom of heaven. You have heard that it was said to the people long ago, You shall not murder, and anyone who murders will be subject to judgment. But I tell you that anyone who is angry with a brother or sister will be subject to judgment. Again, anyone who says to a brother or sister, Raka, is answerable to the court. And anyone who says you fool will be in danger of the fire of hell. Therefore, if you are offering your gift at the altar and there remember that your brother or sister has something against you, leave your gift there in front of the altar. First, go and be reconciled to them. Then come and offer your gift. Settle matters quickly with your adversary who is taking you to court. Do it while you are still together on the way or your adversary may hand you over to the judge and the judge may hand you over to the officer and you may be thrown into prison. Truly I tell you, you will not get out until you have paid the last penny. Meditation who in my life is in need of my love? Closing Prayer Lord, in times of selfish pride, help me to discover humility. Amen.